Okay, the part we have here today is just a uh, inch-long piece of uh, 750 OD uh, stainless bar that we're going to drill a um, 3 8 inch hole through, and then uh, you know chamfer the edges and such, and then uh, go ahead and throw it in the tumbler. Um, and that's going to be pretty much it for these parts. This job is going to be 100 parts long. Uh, there's not really much to explain about it, but here's a video. I hope you like the new format. I tried using screenshots, but they weren't coming out very well. I decided to make my own little window, um, add a little bit more information to it. Uh, so I'm going to try to add this to all my videos. Let me know what you think. But in, it's going to be in the bottom left, and it shows you what you know what status I'm in, what G code I'm in, and stuff. But also shows you um, the the feed per rev, the surface feed per minute, and just uh, per minute and um, RPM. It's just a, a static shot. It's it's not actually recording, you know, a video of it, um, because I'm also adding in the tool number, and then to the tr to the right you'll see the tool number, and then an actual representation of the tool I'm using, um, and then below that I'll put the operation that I'm doing. So, uh, for instance, right now it says tool A. It shows the actual tool shape that I'm using and that I'm facing. I hope that will help. Um, you know, show you guys a little bit more of exactly what tool I'm using and feed. Okay, I can't imagine why anybody would want well, a parts collector or a parts grabber or a parts extractor, whatever you want to call it. Uh, because I just love having to dig through all this junk to get the parts. Hey. I'm not sure how many I was supposed to have. I think that was 14. Uh, I haven't really been keeping track of how many it's been counting or how many it's been going. It ran out of the bar, the previous bar, so I had to put a new bar in. Uh, but anyway, so how it goes.